Hello everyone, welcome back again with us at Military TV. In this episode, we're going to see what will most likely cause World War. World War III is a re-emerging concern in the 21st century, as international communities are at loggerheads now more than ever, and wars have broken out in pockets around the globe. Concerns are developing amongst some people as international relations have soured in recent years, opening up opportunities for conflict in countries around the world. With rising military confrontation along the borders of scores of nations across the globe and increased maritime expansion by several others, there is quite a possibility of a world war brewing up beneath the surface. Given the recent global pandemic and international political climate, one can see how some may posit that the Third World War is already upon us. It leads us to ask the question, is World War III already happening and we don't know it? To answer this question, here are a list of possible conflicts which can spiral out of control and trigger a potential world war. Number 1. Armenia versus Azerbaijan Since long, the two former Soviet republics have been locked in a conflict over Azerbaijan's breakaway, the ethnic disputed region of Nagorno-Karabakh and seven surrounding districts. However, July's attack by the Armenian army on the Tovuz district of Azerbaijan changed the scale of the entire scenario, with both sides suffering losses, especially Azerbaijan, who also lost their major general, which further escalated the tensions. Tensions have been so high that Russia had to intervene, as President Vladimir Putin called on both the nations to abide by the ceasefire, which was first signed in 1994 and provided two decades of relative stability. However, with Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan deciding to side with Azerbaijan and holding joint military drills with the nation, Armenia has not held back. The recently acquisitioned S-300 missiles by Armenia from Moscow suggest that if things were to escalate between Yerevan and Baku, a whole host of countries could be involved, including Russia and Turkey, a NATO nation, which could further escalate matters. Number 2. India vs. Pakistan Kashmir has been a sensitive issue for both the nations with the conflicted region being at the back end of violence and heightened military activity leading to two nuclear-powered nations to fight a battle that seems never-ending. Ever since Prime Minister Narendra Modi withdrew the autonomy of the Jammu and Kashmir and split it into two federally administered territories, tensions have only risen further. What complicates it further is Islamabad's backing by China which continues to strengthen the military of Pakistan in order to force New Delhi to divide its resources in fighting each of its borders. Now, with Beijing continuing to back its iron brother Pakistan and vice versa, it could mean a two-sided war for New Delhi. And India has the staunch backing of the US, Russia, and France, which makes the situation very complicated. No one knows what will happen if India faces a two-front war against China and Pakistan. But one thing is for sure, it will be calamitous for the world, since all three nations are nuclear powers. Number 3. Turkey vs. Greece The two East Mediterranean neighbors have been at loggerheads over a wide range of issues, including the overlapping claims over the hydrocarbon resources in the region mapped out by contradictory claims over territories. While France and Germany had earlier intervened to calm tensions, Greece, which is backed by the majority of EU nations, Egypt and the UAE, has continued to stamp its authority by stating that its possession of numerous islands gives it sovereignty over the disputed waters. However, Turkey has refused to budge. Both nations are now beefing up their naval and air forces. With Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan's accusation against European nations for using Greece as bait to descend on the riches of the Mediterranean, Ankara has sent out warships along with a vessel to do seismic surveys in the area, hinting that it will not tolerate other nations coming to the rescue of Greece without a certain price to pay. This conflict could see an unforeseen clash between NATO countries. Number 4. India vs. China There has been an unforeseen upsurge in tensions between the two nations ever since June's Galwan Valley clash in eastern Ladakh, which claimed the lives of 20 Indian and an unspecified number on the Chinese side. 
Prime Minister Narendra Modi has shown his resolve by expanding a ban on 118 Chinese mobile apps to counter its massive presence in internet services. The move was followed by stricter norms for investments. Such decisions have been strongly opposed by China. Now, despite both the nations signing on a five-point consensus involving disengagement of the troops, they have continued to beef up their defenses along the border, with India reportedly deploying the newly inducted Rafale jets against China's missile defense systems at the border, hinting that neither of the two countries are ready to let their guard down just yet. A possible confrontation between India and China will certainly see the U.S. providing both overt and covert assistance to New Delhi. However, both the nations India and China are nuclear powers, with one of the largest military powers on the planet and a full-scale clash between two economic and military giants could plunge the global economy into a point of no return. Considering the current state of our world, there could be a few scenarios that start a global conflict. Number 5. China vs. Taiwan Not much has changed over China's role of being an extreme aggressor as it continues to fight battles across many fronts. One prominent long-going saga has been its clash with Taiwan, which Beijing considers a renegade province. Taiwan is considered by China as part of its own region, and Beijing has left no stone unturned to diplomatically isolate the island by pressuring many countries to change their allegiances to China. With the recent F-16 Viper jets deal worth $62 billion, U.S. has made Taiwan's F-16 fleet to be the largest in Asia, subtly hinting that if China had invasion plans over the island nations, the Trump administration would not think twice in joining hands with Taipei against President Xi Jinping. Lately, China has repeatedly intruded Taiwan Air Defense Zone, while conducting air drills off the island nation's southwestern coast with the Chinese Su-30s and J-10s intruding the Air Defense Identification Zone ADIZ. If Beijing does dare to cross the line, China and the US, the world's two biggest superpowers, will get involved in a direct conflict which is bound to involve NATO nations on the US side and Russia on the Chinese side. Number 6. Iran vs. Israel Iran and Israel have had an escalation in tensions ever since the U.S. decision in 2018 to unilaterally pull out of the 2015's Joint Comprehensive Plan of Action, even before the possibility of a potential clash between two Middle East nations remained extremely high. However, the recent United Nations Security Council's rejection of its draft resolution to extend the arms embargo indefinitely against Iran, a decision which was supported by the likes of Russia and China, has further angered the U.S. It has left Israel to believe that Tehran, who according to them advocates their destruction, will now be looking to acquire a host of modern weaponry from the likes of Moscow, mostly in the form of S-400 missile defense systems and the latest fighter jets. Iran, as it has been claiming, is bound to strike Israel and U.S. bases in the Middle East. Its missiles are also capable to reach most parts of Europe, thus endangering key NATO nations including the UK. With Russia and China staunchly on its side, analysts believe that an attack on Iran could potentially trigger a world war, and that is the reason even the mighty US is treading cautiously on the Iranian matter. So to sum up, the current power dynamic in the world isn't set up in a way to cause a world war anytime soon. The probability of a world war at some point in humanity's future is 100% though. Humans are violent and we are good at making things to kill each other. That's all for today. Don't forget to leave your comment below if you have a great topic to be discussed about military. Thank you for watching.